Finally decided to show. Hey, kid. Sit a spell. Gentlemen, it's good to see you alive, Thaddeus. Uh, how did you... How's her for later? We gotta talk. God damn. You've been to the Shrouded Realm again? Yeah. Every time I'm near a font when it gets absorbed, I just shift over there. Then I see the Pentasod and pow, I'm back. Huh. Pentasod must like you. You don't normally do that, as a general rule, crossing over as a one-way street. This absorbed font you're talking about, it happened to be where you think you saw Sandrak die? Rhetorical question, kid. It was. That's how Sandrak got himself into the Shrouded Realm. <coughs> uh, do what now? There was likely a tiny hole left there where the font was. A sliver, lingering a bit between worlds. Probably crawled his mangy ass through it in the nick of time. Lucky some bitch. Back up. What makes you think Sandrak went to the Shrouded Realm? Because he crawled back out recently. He's close by, too. I can smell him. There's a snuffed out fawn over here in Kelpis. That's where he probably is. Take this. It'll bring you right to him. I figure he'll be weak, convalescing and whatnot. He ain't moved from what we can gather. Pulling himself back, probably about tore him to shreds. Why not use the font that would have taken him to Rasharn? Rasharn's a dangerous place for a tyrant showing weakness. 
Sandrak has enemies at court. He's smart to avoid them if he can. All right, then. Round three. Sandrak will have summoned his personal guard to watch over him. You won't be able to avoid him. You know what that means, right? The girl. She'll be there alongside all your unfinished business. Thanks, guys. I'd ask you to help, but you would have offered by now. Yeah, I'm still on the mend after getting gut shot by your aforementioned friend. And my kind live in a cave for a reason, kid. Out there, we tend to get killed by folks less enlightened than yourself. But good luck, and make it hurt. Before you leave, kid, hit up that spell altar. It's got something you'll need. What's the deal with this spell? It's a ward breaker. Something tells me you'll need it to get close to Sandrak. Guess I'll give this spell a try. How you been, kid? Last I saw you, you were searching for the Shrine Forge. I suspect you found it if you tackled Sandrak head on. Yeah, we found it. With Kenzie's help, by the way. Then I kind of broke it, but... Mm-hmm. Feels like your thing. Walking into a place the first time and tripping over shit like a toddler. And to fire up a few constructs to help get my polar back in shape after your visit. I told you I was sorry. Anyway. I found out how Sandrak was able to control the Binding Stone. There was a machine that you could get a mark from. Oh, and by machine, I mean an ancient, giant, Aristean ghost guy thing. How about you two play catch up after Sandrak's in the ground? And how about you mind your own business? Ignore him. We got time to talk. Maybe you can tell me how you aren't dead. No real mystery. I make sure to carry a healing crystal on me at all times. Habit from a lifetime of soldiering. It's nice to feel missed, though. So here's something pretty embarrassing and terrible. The Immortals gave me the boot. Something tells me that ain't by choice. Catch you fraternizing with the enemy stuck in your head? That's not what it is! I, I mean, yes, it totally looks like it, but like... But it's messy. That's what I said! Look. I got the very dubious benefit of having you two bouncing around in my head, sharing all your conflict and history and whatnot, but your pals at the Palathon don't got that context. So what do I do? To avoid high treason? Fuck if I know. I just said it was messy, not fixable. I suspect killing Sandrak's a good first step, though. You were Grand Magnus of the Immortals when Sandrak was part of the Order, weren't you? Guilty. Surprised you know about that. Figured Lavenry would have had Kirkin scrub his name from the record. She gave me a report of the whole thing. Incomplete, but yeah. Huh. You must be real special to her. That's, uh, that's nice to hear. Kirkin needs good people to surround herself with, or she can get a bit, um... What? Nothing. Shouldn't talk out of turn. Anywho, yes, it was me who found Sandrak and sponsored him for selection. Didn't give a rat's ass he was Ray Sharnian. I'm old enough to remember when our two kingdoms were allies. What was he like? Smart. Had grit. Unorthodox with his magic in the way all you Triarchs are. He and Kirkin? Whew. You ain't never seen a pair so fierce. No one could stand against them. Except their own egos. And ultimately, he was my mistake. Does Kenzie know you're alive? She deserves to hear it from you. Nope, I haven't. I suspect I won't. Don't be an asshole. You mean a lot to her, Thaddeus. 
pouring it on thick, kid. And if I recall correctly, it was you who told everyone I was dead, not me. I got a split. You do that. Next time, fellas. Not right now, Jack. Devin, please. This is going to sound crazy, but you have to listen to me. I just spoke with Thaddeus. They're right about the crazy. Listen, Sandrak's alive. Hurt, but alive. You need to lock the vault down tight. Put the whole Palathon on alert. I'm... On my way. Can't let you face him alone. No, if I fail here, Sandrak will come for the Binding Stone. You have to be there to stop him. Please answer, or show up, or come on. Luna, if you can hear me, you know I'm coming. You know what I have to do, I'm begging you. Don't try to stop me. Sandrak.
Ni Sadatish. Ordlet said Leomi. Are you sure sending them away is a good idea? You can't talk me out of this. No one here needs to die. Mm, but they really do, though. Let him live, and we'll pull our forces from the front. You have the Binding Stone. You've won the war. He'll see that. He listens to my counsel. Sandrak's not the warmonger your Grand Magnus makes him out to be. He won't let Roshanians fight a battle we can't win. Listen to yourself. Have you completely forgotten? He's been trying to conquer the world since we were kids? Kirkin drove him to that. He used to be one of you. I don't care. I'm asking you to care. To make it stop here. You've handed her the Binding Stone, the control of all magic, and she's still going to invade Rashan just to make an example of us. Both of our people will die for no reason at all. One of us has to be the first side to quit. Our people, huh? Grow up. We can change how this works, Jack. The war, all of it. Right here. You and I. We can get them to listen. Remind them that the real goal is healing the wound. Children. Stop! To me, Ulian Zochi, when he lord she's a chum. Esherar Tadelianar, no Eshasan. Surrender, just for Lucians. Where are you, Thradakul? Leave it. Come home to the front. They need to see their leader alive and with them as the Lucians approach. They need help. I won't take the advice of someone whose loyalty is so obviously <laughs> divided. The Binding Stone's too far for that to work, genius. I'm not bringing it to me. I'm bringing myself to it. Ah, the Parathon Vault, of course. No, wait! This will give them hope. Well, shit. Sandrak's inside the Palathon. You've got to raise the alarm. What? That's not possible. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear what? Portal's opening all over. Nightblade's inbound. I'm coming. I need to find Devin. Here they come.
How the hell is this happening? Sandrak pulled himself to the Binding Stone somehow. The Binding Stone you didn't destroy. Yeah, that one. Thanks. Brilliant. I couldn't stop him. It came out of nowhere. Captain, rally our people and secure the upper floors. And if you... If you see it starting to turn, signal all hands for an evacuation. Flyers, craft, drop skiffs. This is Captain Selko. Sandrak is heading to the path. Kirkin's intercepting, but I won't make it in time. The font... On it, sir. Devin, lock this area down until backup arrives. Hell I will. If Sandrak absorbs the font, the Palafon goes into free fall. You can't help, Devin. I've got the mark. It's the only thing that stands a chance against him right now. Glad to have you back. Hmm. More coming in! here. Understood. Good luck. Kirkin, sir, this is Jack. I'm closing in on your location. You copy? Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> 
It won't be a court-martial, Sandrak. It will be incineration. I highly encourage you to think about this. How could you? Generations of Roshanians unable to produce my life. Good. agreed at the conclave of Gulhad. To hell with Gulhad. All Gulhad did was pretend the Everwar was polite. You've crippled them, Kirk. You've single-handedly damaged Roshan society beyond repair. Their culture, all their lives to come. My people! You've served the Immortals for 30 years. You've warred against Roshan the whole time. You don't get to decide when they're your people and when they're really your people. I will go to Lavery. I will expose this abominable operation and your role in it. The King endorsed this operation. He was also the one that insisted it be kept from you until its success was verified. I will tell them. The consuls of Lucia, the world... ...will kill you first. Now, now. This will be a liberation. They've squandered your power on this place. This cheap theater. I think we're past that trick now, don't you? This place is alive, Sandrak. You'll kill her and everyone aboard the Palathon if you absorb that font! I'll carry their memories with me. But winning at all costs requires a resilience to sin. You told me that. No! Wait! Even the Pentasad has reason to fear me now. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Ah!
Devin! What did you do? I won. Just run, Jack. It's okay. No! Don't! Huh. I'm alive. Just hold on, Jack. Oh, what is that smell? Oh, seriously, it's like something died in here. It's Saren. You've just forgotten how much it reeks. You saved me. That's what friends are for, right? You're finally looking better. What's that? Sandrak won, Jack. You remember that? A little while after the Palathon fell, these... These shackles just appeared on the arms of every Magnus on Avium. They block our access to the Ley Lines. Magic. Sandrak controls all of it. The war's over. Well, not all Magni have lost their power. The loyal ones out there still have their sigils. Not so much for fugitives like me. Rasharnians have occupied the city? Every city, as far as I can tell. There are some holdouts. Glavegate, a few of the Claylish Isles. But their magic is gone too. They won't last. This is my fault. All of it. I'm so sorry. You dream of it all the time. Of your friend, Devon. I experience it through you. Our mind link still works despite these. That's how I saw them save you. Capture you. A bit of both. Rashan needed Magni, though, so I went from prisoner to war college pretty fast. And that's all it took for you? To renounce Lucium and everything? Free tuition? One, don't ever knock free tuition. Two, I renounced Lucium when I found out why Rashan desperately needed Magni. How awfully Lucium and Kirken have treated their enemies. You and your friends pretty much worked for the bad guys, Jack. Oh, and Sandrak's not king of the world. Bat shit insane. Look, I don't care. Did any of the others make it? I don't know. I barely caught you in time. I need some air. You won't like what's out there. Aren't you afraid one of them will recognize you? Not outside of the uniform. Rashan's really enjoying this. This isn't Rashan. This is the Moorbane. The who? Sandrax Butcher. These are his soldiers. Not even part of the army, really. Just a pack of wild dogs. Sandrax punishing Saren because of me. So these holdouts you mentioned. Gladegate still resisting Sandrak and Kalthus. That's interesting. My friend, uh, my field commander, Zandara, she's Kalthusian royalty. If she survived the Palathon, she'll have fallen back to Glavegate. If I could get there. Big if. There he is. The Morbane. Saren, these whispers of rebellion. They make your children weep. Accept anguish. 
Internalize it. A prisoner with him. You'll be more Their lights at be. peace. Hiding these it's an execution. The Lucian army. We all know it hurts them worse. In the end. Sandrax not the warmonger you make him out to be, huh? Remember saying that to me? I can't take in much more of this. I gotta get out of here. I think a big patrol goes by up ahead. Let's stop here for a bit. Sandrak did have a plan, you know. It was sound, actionable, and in the end, the world would have benefited from the war we were waging. You sound like Kirkin. Don't ever compare me to her. Look, I can't justify what Sandrak's doing now. He's lost his fucking mind. But there was an honor in him that your Grand Magnus could never even pretend to have. I know you saw a different side to her, and probably- Luna, you really need to cut it out with this. Kirkin took me in when I lost everything. Who wouldn't take in a Triarch that just dropped in their lap? I mean it. Rashan hasn't produced a Magnus in ten years, Jack. Magic doesn't take to our people anymore. What does that have to do with Kirkin? She's the one that sent the Immortals that did it. They infiltrated their way to the Hang Isles, poisoned the ley lines across the skies of Rashan. All of our children have been born lightless ever since. Wait, what? I is it permanent? We don't know. No one's been able to lift the curse, not even Sandrak with the Binding Stone. Without new magic coming in, Rashan's culture and traditions are dying. You understand the horror of it, right? Our entire identity is fading away. Kirkin's ruthless, but she wouldn't poison the ley lines like that. You don't believe me? I believe Sandrak blames her for it, because of course he would. The connection our magical bloodlines have with the ley lines is gone. Wiped out. Sterilized. So that's why Rasharn kidnaps Magni from other countries? Who are the bad guys again? In a few years' time, Rashan would have been unable to defend itself in the Everwar. So Sandrak took shortcuts to end it. I'll say. Just thought you should know how we really got to this point. Are we done here? I don't know, are we? What made you decide to bring us to Saren? Because you're heavy. I knew I wouldn't have flight for long and Saren was close. Anyway, we grew up here. More than half of that time hiding from someone or another that meant us harm. Figured we could use that to our advantage. The Morbane, though, he's something I didn't count on. It's strange being here. It really is, huh? The whole time I served in the Light's Army, I never came back. A lot of bad memories. Bad smells. <laughs> the worst. I was out for a month, huh? What else did I miss? News from the outside world? It's rare. I only learned about Glavegate because I overheard the Rashanians talking about it. But what about the front? No such thing. The Lucian lines fell back, dissolved. Lots of Light's army hiding along the coasts of Kylae now. Oh, a few of the Sky Clans of Oromen put up a fight, until Sandrak threatened to pull the magic out from under their floating islands. So essentially, it all sucks. Oh, well, gets better. There have been whispers about the Pentasad lately, that something's wrong with it. Wrong how? I don't know. It's hard to tell from here. Any way we can get a message to my friend at Glavegate? Farcall stones are dead, couriers only work for Sandrak, and Kalthus is on the other side of the womb. So there's a chance. After the Palathon, Sandrak immediately cut off communications across Avium. The first step to total control is enforcing silence. And I'm the in... Never mind. What's wrong? As the Hand, I ran counter-surveillance for the Order of Masks, cataloging enemy command networks to find out where they were most vulnerable. He used what I built for him. I can't take that pot back. You were fighting a war, Luna. That's how you do it. What made you go rogue and save me from the Palathon? Seriously? You told me. The next time we see each other, one of us is going to kill the other. Just saying. That turned out different. Sandrak was... He was changing. It became less about fixing wrongs done to Rashan and more about just hurting everyone. About domination. 
That's not what I signed up for. Oh. Thought it might be because we were best friends. Look, the cave in Kalthus? There was a moment there where you hesitated. Where you heard me. We can change how this works, Jack. The war, the wound, all of it. Right. We had a chance at peace. Kirken and Sandrick were just in the way. You saw that. Of course I was going to save you. I'm done. Let's go. Great. I'll take care of it. Novetastali, Magnosar. And Zunanen, Numichin, Nuzerdatin, Yodomu. Voye Rashar? Hey! Tukas, Okasarme Ilen? Leave her alone. We're just going home. Zelentas, et uses to mitasam. Stare at the ground. Just do what they say. Achiliesi de sam. Cesara yesti de domo. Cesau zesem uturaicha yinayan. destroyed it. The Binding Stone. I had the chance and didn't take it. Now... Now this. You did what you thought was right. That's a hard thing to do, you know? Most people avoid conviction. I got him killed. Then take Tenji to Zevet! It was mine! Let me go! The... Esher Enshan I listened to the kid. Jack, wait! I can't take it. You're on. Holy shit. How did you do that? The mark must still be tied to the binding stone. So it can undo its magic. We need sigils. Shit! Come on! We'll take the lift! What are we... The safe house is the other way! I stashed our gear someplace else. It's close. Good. When word of that fight gets out, things are gonna pop off. Word got out. You know, I just realized I never said thanks for saving my life. Now it's in danger again. Go you. Whoa, holy shit. It's home. What's left of it? Our armor, sigils, they're all in there. Five years. And no one's even bothered to rebuild the place. Love what you've done with the place. Where's the stash? That's the stuff. Don't laugh. <laughs> what are you doing? Seeing if I can fly it's yet. It's not working. You don't say. My connection to the ley lines is still pretty shit. It'll get there. In the meantime, I guess we take the elevator to topside. They've got it locked down with wards. I know how to break them, though. Let's split up. I'll get to the elevator controls, take out the guards there, we meet back up, and... And get the fuck up on out of here. It's a plan. Hey, wait. I, uh... I held on to this for you. You kept this? Why? Why do you think? Hold on to it. You know, in case we don't see each other again.
I'm almost at the elevator. I deactivated the wards. Hold tight. I'll be there soon. Immortal. Oh, the Morbane. Thought you'd show. Sendrick thought you might return here. Gutterets prefer a familiar nest. Where's the traitor? I kill you both, I can finally leave this shithole and have it all thrown into the wound. There's no. Remembered how to fly.
Jack, you need to see this. That's new, and awful. It's causing the wound to spread faster now. Sandrax summoned so much magic up from the Shrouded Realm that it's boiling over. It's too concentrated to hold. Especially if you're also keeping everyone else's magic in check. I know he doesn't see this as his fault. He's probably just offended by it. As if the Pentasod was denying him some final lordship. I can buy us some time. Gave everybody their magic back. You did not. I did it for us. What's the difference? A uh, scale? You're earnestly being humble, and I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Let's find a portal to take us to Glavegate. Meet up with Zendara and whoever else is there. I'm not going to Glavegate. What? No, don't worry about Zendara. I'll explain how you're on our side now in a conversation I'm honestly not feeling 100% about right now. But I'm not. Not really. I'm done, Jack. I've turned against my own people. I can't go back to Rashan. Lucium is no longer my home. I'm just... done fighting for either of them. Come on. Don't leave me again. Help me. I told myself that I'd go when you were on the mend. Well, just disappoint yourself and don't do that. I'm sorry. I just... I can't bring myself to fight him. You have to, Luna. The wound is spreading. We don't know how much longer we have. We don't need to. My best friend's going to stop it. I need to get to Gladegate and find Zendara.
wave gate. I've got to get down there and find Zendara. Form our lines. The next wave's on its way. I thought you died. With Devon. I'm just here to help. Feels like you need it. We were able to push them out here beyond the wall once our magic came back. That was you, wasn't it? Yeah. I made a mistake. I'm trying to fix it. Here's your chance. Thaddeus? Good to see you, kid. Me too. Yeah. Thought you could use some more guns. I'll take it. Hold this position while Jack and I reinforce the main gate.
There's been no word from Kirkin since the Palathon fell. So, this is it, huh? We're what's left of the Immortals? We? Hey now, alumni count. Jack of Saren! Yeah. Speaking of alone. You're to come to my flagship alone, or I'll kill everyone here. I've let the Queen's Rebellion go on long enough as it is. You can try. Don't go crawling his hump, kid. Not yet. Hump is what? It means don't go picking a fight. I think I might know why he's here. Sandrak! Been a minute? Ted? You look well. Well, you don't. You look wicked. Like a root grown wrong where the earth didn't want it. Who's picking a fight now? Shh. Watch. He's gonna bind him to an oath. I'm surprised you've come out of hiding. Yeah, weren't my first choice, but I owed the kid a favor. You mean it about him? He goes with you, he's safe. Gaia Sarastaya, Uenura Jachi. Ometedeliame, Atameni. You'll be there in due course. You just signed me up for what? Ah, uh, clean out your ears. He said you're going to his flagship. Can you think of a better way? To die? No, dummy. To figure out what Sandrak's plan is. A wound expanding this much, this fast? He knows he done fucked up. Thinks he needs another tryout to help him fix it. You have nothing to back any of that up. Now look, Sandrak went so nut nut, we got no choice. I'll go. He's right. Jack, I'm so glad you're alive. Kirkin. Holy shit, where are you? Sandrak's flagship. I've been his guest for some time now. Better get back to Greyvale. You better go, kid. I'll hold down the fort here with Zendara. Even if she's none too fond of me on Kirkin's behalf. I'm just glad that she's not calling me initiate every five seconds anymore. Well, how come? That's a term of Boku respect here in Kelthus. Hold up. Really? That's what their magni call each other. The initiates of Thal. Both sworn to the braided lords of Kelthus. Calling you that is like calling you one of her own. You're shitting me. This whole time? World's chock full of mystery and misconstruals, ain't it? Anything else I could demystify for you before you leave? Why'd you stop being the Grand Magnus of the Immortals? Yeah. Here it is. What do you know about the Mandate? Using our magic corrupts Avium, so it's our duty to restore it when we find signs of that corruption. So you don't know shit about the Mandate, then? If there's more to it, tell me. One benefit of not being your Grand Magnus? Telling you the rest of it ain't my responsibility no more. Whatever it is, you wouldn't go along with it. Or were afraid to. Detective time's over, champ. Subject sickens me to the core. And to think I convinced others the mandate was any kind of path to virtue makes it a hundred times worse. What's wrong with the Pentasod? That nightmare mass of malignancy pulling at its skirt? Here to stay had a word for it that escapes me at the moment. More or less, man, doomsday window. So, you know, can't be all that bad. Like I said, that's what Sandrak's wanting your help with. Now that magic's back on, can you see what's in my head? 
how'd you think I knew you were in a bit of a spot here? Yeah, that mind link's back. Just fits and spurts, though. So hopefully it's petering out. I want it to go away just as much as you do, believe me. Take care of yourself, Thaddeus. Will do. Stay sharp, kid. Pretty sure I can take an air skiff from Lucium to Sandrax flagship. Won't be hard to find. Rashaan's been amassing an armada on the wound side of the border for some time. Frankly, I was worried it might be coming here. So how'd you do it? You mean restore your magic? No. How'd you survive? I thought the worst. <sighs> okay. So don't get angry, but... It turns out that my childhood friend Luna, the one that I thought was dead, turns out she actually ended up being the hand of Sandrak. What? <laughs> I know, right? Anyway, she ended up betraying him at the last minute and saved me. Then we hid out in Saren for a while before I figured out how to get those crazy shackles off. I asked her to come here, but- Are you okay? This sounds made up. It does doesn't it? Also, I'm going to act like you made it up, because I really don't want to end up killing you. Because, in the end, you and I are Because solid. if I did, you wouldn't show up to your meeting with Sandrak, and then he'd end up killing the rest of us. Look, it's not as bad as you think. What I think is that it sounds insane, Jack. And if it's true... No, I, I can't even think about it being true. Zendara. No, Jack. I appreciate your help here, but I don't think we should talk right now. Selko, I knew you'd make it. Jack, I'll admit you were gone for so long I was starting to worry. We had no way of searching for you. Sandrak dismantled our scrying network, and we dared not risk an airship. I was pretty banged up for a while, hiding out in Saren as a friend nursed me back to health. Well, I'd like to hear that story. Is your friend here? Um, no. We, um, we had to go our separate ways. It's a uh, longer story than you think. I've never heard him so scared, you know. Sandrak. He fears you, sir. No, he needs me. That's the scary part. Needing someone is a vulnerability. Exploit it. That's the plan. In theory, anyway. And thanks, by the way, for getting as many as you could out of the Palathon. We're all in your debt.
Forgive us for starting early. Lavenish wolf herring is a frail plate at this altitude. I lost my appetite when you started threatening my friends. Ah, the misplaced, puff-chested vigor of youth. That's what was missing from the menu. You really are missing out. I resurrected the herring just for this occasion. A Lucian delicacy now extinct, a victim of the war. Doomed to Kirkin's gallery of vanished things, save for tonight. From the ether to your dish. Salut. At least you have your divine priorities straight. You're referring to the problem we're having with the wound. We've been working on a way to fix that. What is that? And hold on, you're working with him? I can conquer the world, Jack. But I can't save it. The wound widens faster every day now. With the power of the fonts, it obeys all of my commands. Except to stop. Maybe you broke it. This isn't me. The locus of energy at the base of the Pentasade? It's called the Maladar. The Aristean sign of the apocalypse. I know you've seen the Pentasad shrouded form, Jack. The so-called king of magic. Simultaneously standing there in the center of the wound, as if celebrating its hold on us. While skulking about in the dark below like some thonic puppeteer. This thing we blindly venerate? It's a demon, some wrathful god of old that loathes to share its wealth. When the Magni first learned to harness the Ley Lines, the Pentasad created the wound out of jealousy to punish them. Magic isn't destroying the world. The Pentasad is. Luna said you'd say something just like this. The Maladar it opened is one last gambit against the man who threatens to replace it. I want you to travel to the Shrouded Realm with me. Together, we can kill it. Kill it? The ship we built will take you there. Wait, you're seriously on board with this? This is Avium in a matter of days, Jack. We have to stand together on this. I can see no other way. Two things. First, you let me try to talk to it before we resort to violence. There has to be another solution. Second, I'm going to kill you when we're done. For Devin. These terms are entirely fair. Okay. Let's go. Can we go through the wound to reach the Shrouded Realm? In a way. Symbolically, yes. The deepest magics are based on ritual and reenactment. We perceive the Shrouded Realm as below us, so our descent here is a, a performance. And performance coupled with will creates reality. And you're using the Binding Stone to enhance that. Exactly right. This bathosphere Kirken and I engineered focuses its power and our will. If we pretend hard enough to go to the world below us, then inevitably we will get there. Ideas fall into it, as do memories. Why do you think the details of the past are so hard for us to remember? It's not senility, or the ineptitude of scholars, or the boot tramp of war, or anything mundane at all. It's parts of history literally sliding into this impossible void. As it's grown over the years, the wound's increasing gravity has even pulled concepts from our heads before we think of them. Pulled words from pages of now empty books, The Shrouded Realm, Atava, the wellspring of magic, dream, and prophecy. Sister to Avium and the land above. Oh, my head, what is that? It's said that life here requires senses beyond our own. Yours are compensating. Stay strong or it will be painful. After my injuries in the Deep Mere, my brief journey here was excruciating. All that corruption. This place is becoming a landfill. Some believe our realms are imperfect shadows of each other. When one dies, the other follows suit. 
The Maladar is destroying them both. It wasn't this bad before. The Pentasad made these rules. I will unmake them. We will unmake them. Now that you have left Kirk and suicide cult. What's that supposed to mean? Of course. She never told you that immortals are charged with sacrificing themselves to heal the wound at the end of their tenure. Such a pointless endeavor. That sounds like an amazing amount of bullshit. Walk with me. I'll explain. The Immortals. It's a farce. You clean up small piles of corruption here and there, but that only lasts until you're too old to serve. Then she sends you to clean up a field with a ritual that will end your life, take your soul. Kirkan's agenda needed orphans like yourself to recruit, use up, and sacrifice to keep the corruption at bay. You're lying. Am I? Ask Thaddeus why he left. It's not a grand order of warrior magni, Jack. It's a sack of compost. You've been bred for sacrifice in order to grow a better gun. General, inform Grand Magnus Kirken that she may take her leave without delay. Provide her passage to wherever she wishes. It will most likely be Glade. Leave, You're going to let her go? Just like that? Our vessel has reached its destination, so I have no need of her services anymore. I was only keeping her to influence our small alliance. Did you save her from the Palathon? I did. I realized my revenge would mean nothing without her to suffer. You're insane. Very probably. Onward. Okay, what's this supposed to be? In my way. We'll need to work together on this. Sure, this is the right place? The Pentasad has known we were here since we landed. It should show itself any moment now. Be careful, brother. Are you sure this parley of yours is still wise? Yes, stand down. Hi, I'm Jack. I was hoping we could talk. I have this friend. He says you might have taken a liking to me, so maybe you'll hear me out? This isn't working. Sandrak, chill. The Maladar is destroying our world. Uh, worlds. If he's right about you, maybe you can help us. My friend Rook, I mean. He's in a lorry, and, well, we were... Wait, stop! I bring you down, rude creature. With the Thrada Cull, I refuse you. Ah! Help me, boy! I... Why did you send me here? What are you trying to say? I've seen this architecture before. In the underworld, the Alori. They came from the shrouded.
That's like, I don't even know how many thousands of years ago.
gather to me. Your minds are young and your fears unfounded. Our journey upward is a good thing. The Pentasad makes of the Athorian humans a perfect cycle. They will draw magic upwards from the fonts, and our powers will return it. create wonders with magic that will astonish us. As long as we are there to heal the wounds they make in their innocence.
rest. They will cherish us, the children of the Pentacide. That hasn't aged well. As soon as humans encountered the Alori, we started slaughtering them.
glory, their the Penasod made them to be a, a safety valve. They were never stealing our magic, they were trying to filter it. The corruption magic creates an avium. The Alori would have prevented it by sending it back here. There would have never been a wound. Didn't even give them a chance. All we saw was that they drained magic, so we killed as many of them as we could as soon as we met them and drove the rest away. Sandrak, I've got to stop him. We can put all this back together. Follow me. Together we can finish it. No. Don't fight it at all. Listen, the Penasod showed me how to... Resist its illusions. It will show you anything it needs to survive. Don't be a coward, boy. Sandra, will you listen to me? Stop attacking it. You came here to help me. I came here to help you fix the wound. God damn it! You're going to get everyone killed, asshole! Uh. 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 Those oaths really have teeth, Ted. Damn. Oh, shit! Smells like you just fell out of the Shrouded Realm. Alarming twist. The Pentasod sent me here. Whatever it's selling, I ain't buying. Hmm. Hold on, Rook. Hear me out. No. That thing can go fuck itself. It tricked us. Told us Avia would be one big ball of paradise. Now get out of here before- Before you eat me. I know. I know. Just stop and listen. Ah! The mouth on you. Somewhere along the way, you forgot I ain't human, Jack. Big cantankerous rook. We go way back. The vast big gulf of hate between us is all gone. He sees me as one of the good ones. Newsflash, pissant. You got, you got good reason to hate me. You hate all of us. <laughs> we deserve it for what we did. That's on us, though. Not the Pentasod. It needs your help. It's for you. Jack, can you hear me? Mind link's on the fritz. This don't seem much better. I'm kinda busy right now. You gotta get to Glavegate, pronto. Going to the Shrouded Realm was only Sandrak's first plan to kill the Pentasod, but he had a backup. If that didn't work, Use the binding stone to pull the Pentasod into our world. It'll be weaker here. He can do that? Yeah, according to my scry stones, he is doing it. Right now. Worst part, Kirkin's still all in on it. 
telling everyone here they need to settle up with Sandrak and join the fight. You've got to stop her, Thaddeus. Tell her I have another way to fix this. Sure. Like she gonna listen to me. I already tried. Try harder. If the Penisa dies, that's it. We're done. It's all done. I'm on my way. I'm bringing the Alori. You lied straight to the man's face, kid. Didn't even blink. Your glory will never know rest. Oh. It showed you that. To what? Tug at my conscience? No. To make sure I'd see that the only person that can save us all is you. Please, come to Glavegate. Happy you could finally join us. Your Lori friends were a no-show. They'll be here. I'm done waiting. Air Commanders, prepare to join the Rasharnian assault. Sir, you can't do this. The Pentasod isn't causing the Maladar. It's suffering from it. Sandrak and the Binding Stone You think I don't know all of this? He's insane. He literally believes the Pentasod went berserk because it's jealous. Then why are you joining him? The fonts are gone. The pentasad that made them is broken, unanchored, imploding, and all of Avium is crumbling apart as it lashes out. Nothing else matters. Lucium isn't joining Sandrak's mad crusade, Jack. We're using it so we can cauterize the wound at the source. What a crock of shit. Sorry for crashing in. Magna, I got a real blind spot for Alori. The kid says you need our help. And from what I've heard of your plan, he's right by a mile. And just what help could you possibly give us? Look, lady, I ain't happy to be here either. We've had a bone to pick with your people for, I don't know, a few thousand years? We have a lot to make up for. This is how it's supposed to be. Whatever magic the Magni take from the Ley Lines, the Elori funnel back to where it came from. No corruption, no wound. Yeah, well, what he's showing us squares with my research. This whole mess started once the Elori were banished. You know what you're doing is impossible. I'm right next to you. Pentasad is helping. We're tight. Tell me, Jack. Did you bring any other visions of perfect harmony that you saw in the Shrouded Realm that are actually relevant to the battle at hand? The Alori can heal the wound? We can start over? It won't happen immediately. We've corrupted so much. But it won't happen at all if we do what you're asking. Selko, get him out of here. Zendara, get your airships ready for transport and- No. I did not just hear that. Selko. Relieve the Grand Magnus of command. Bullshit like this is why I live in a cave. Lucium surrendered to Sandrak a month ago. Kalthus is still free. That makes me the ranking officer of the Immortals by Ancient Treaty. Look it up. You're making a mistake you can't undo. Take it up with Lavenry. If you help us, all the territories west of the Orenthals are yours. It's not much, but you'll have a sky. We can work out the rest from there. You're in no position to make such an offer. <clears throat> By law, we're a renegade army. She's the queen of Kelthus. Damn well do whatever she wants here. We were gonna help regardless, but sure, we'll take bonus freedom. Signal the commanders that there's been a change of plans. Please, sir. You can still help us. 
You're heading into disaster, Jack. The world ends because of what you chose today. Just give the word, Initiate. Captain, I really appreciate the support. I know you and Kirk can go way back, so it couldn't have been easy for you. I'm loyal to the Immortals, not Kirken. I get that, but still, I'm just saying. Permission to speak freely, sir. <clears throat> Say what's on your mind. It was a whole month, sir. Sandrak's hold on magic. The Magni outside of the Order of Masks had lost their power, and none of them knew if it would ever come back. It broke some of them. It affected all of them. What are you saying? Kirken was wrong, but I can't help wondering if her response to the present crisis wouldn't have been so severe if the Magni hadn't felt so helpless before. Hadn't felt so afraid. You've got a big heart, Soko. More than most Magni deserve. I'm glad you're with us. Thaddeus, thanks for the backup. Everywhere you go, you cause a ruckus. I've never seen Kirkin that angry, kid, and I've seen Kirkin angry. If the Alori weren't here, that could have gone a whole nother way. Back in... Deep down, Kirkin knows that killing the Pentasod isn't the answer. She'll... she'll be there. Kid, I watched her walk away stage left. She ain't gonna be anywhere near what we're doing. Hate to say it, you're gonna have to come to terms with the very real possibility that she's written you off for life. Assuming we survive. So, hey, I got this weird favor to ask. Speak up! What weird Sh favor? Was that necessary? Look, my friend Luna. Gel that gut shot me? Yeah, she's a favorite. That one, yeah. I wanted to talk to her, but I don't know where she is. And I don't know how to do this, you know, this mind thing where I could find out. Uh-huh. So I was thinking, maybe, since we three share the whole thing between us, you could help me track her down somehow. How? You and I combine our thinking real hard? It's not gonna work if you make it sound stupid. Jack? Holy shit, we did. Why does everything smell like honeysuckle and eggs? Hey, now. Oh, great. Whatever you want to say, Jack, you better say it now. I can't maintain this Tom fuckery for long. Luna. What's he talking about? Tim Eggs was fresh. You're supposed to leave me. This is it, Luna. One last battle against Sandrak. If we lose, the wound swallows everything. You can't ignore this. Are you <sighs> shitting me? Sorry, kid. That's harder than it looks. She's gone. All right. Save your strength. We got to go. Well, that was a whole thing. That's an understatement. Are you doing okay about Kirkin? Of course I'm not. But what's done is done. So do I call you Grand Magnus now, or what? Do you ever give things time to process, Initiate? So you're saying we should table it and go? I am. Are you ready? Yeah, uh, I need to take care of some things. Maybe talk to some of the others. Do what you need to, but hurry. You actually came. I I'm kind of speechless. That's, uh, first. And you should be thanking the boys. They're the ones who voted we help you. They heard you guilt tripping me, kept it up after you left. Oh, come on. No one tells you to do anything. You could say it. Say what? Haircut made a good point, see? And so I'm a sitting at a crossroads of conscience, see? You know what I don't smell on you? A proper fear of me. Should I be getting worried? Oh, you're definitely worried around me. Heebie jeebies all over you like lice whenever I'm close. But no fear. Magnicia Lori, that's the first thing that pops up. Historically. They scream, freak out, run away. Then make up stories about how horrible... There was plenty of fear the first time we met. Sure. 
I gave off a lot of gonna eat your face off type overtones. But then we just started talking and you you just turned into a normal guy, you know? This guy I know with horns. Uh, I was getting to this theory I have about you and your no fear. What do you humans call your kind? Unfortunate? Unforeseen? Also, I'm still human. Is that so? All the Magni treat you like one? I mean, yeah. Well, for the most part. Mm -hmm. So, I think because you're an unforeseen, because you remember a time where you didn't have magic, you don't got the same ingrained fear of Alori as someone who's had magic their whole life. We just don't set you off the same way as we do the off-the-shelf Magni, the Dynasty Magni. Interesting theory. Or maybe it's just because I think you're all right. Don't sell yourself short, Rook. We doing this? Yeah, we're doing this. Air commanders have their final orders, sir. We're ready to embark and engage over the moon. Keep our scrying officers silent until I give the signal. Sandrak still thinks we're coming to help. They won't know what hit them. Just need to get close enough to drop us on Sandrak's flagship. My boys will break away and try to dampen whatever Sandrax spells have got its hooks in the Pentasod, pulling it through. Good a plan as any, except, well... <clears throat> our airships are powered by magic. How are we supposed to transport the Alori? You ain't. Fellas, time to gussy up. I wanted to see that. We can really do this. Good hunting, people. Did he really just yell wahoo? I was feeling it. Sir, Roshanian airship bearing for the Alori. We can't stop it. You have to, Captain. We can't do this without them. Strip it! Not bad. This is all on you now, Initiate. No, no. Last time it was just up to me, I made the biggest mistake of my life. We're only going to win this one together. Stitch of up.
Moving initiate! Oh, 
I'm getting close to Sandrak. Should I wait for you? There's no time. Go! Jack, Kirkham betrays me with a doomed assault with you at the head. No. She was still all in on your plan. But my friends and I had a different idea. Oh, -ho. you turned against her. Wonderful. I've had a good influence on you. They're the key, Sandrak. If you really want to heal the wound, you're going to let them finish. You know I'm right. I admit, your army of gargoyles is something I didn't see coming. Children of the Pentasad, are they not? Cruel of you to bring them just to see it die. You must want to build yourself a little family of orphans again. After all you have seen, you still insist on prolonging the world's suffering. Van Breaking your magic, no skill. Vanti for Should have been a lesson. Should I fall, Avian will follow.
cohesion. Not meet my end like this. You cannot touch me. Jack, in all of its varied hues of panic, the realization that even immortality is pleased. Sup? Sup? The traitor returned at last. You dishonor everything I gave you, sister. That Rashan gave you. You're so full of shit. You sold our people a dream you abandoned the moment I handed you the power to fulfill it. You don't always have to wait until I'm on the ropes to swoop in, you know? I don't. You're just always on the ropes. Do you know how many Lucians she's killed, Jack? And you, sister. How many of your countrymen have died in his hand? You were unforeseen. I fell. BJ! Betray your masters for what? A chance at power? And then which of you will betray the other if I fall? Get behind me! With the Prada Cull, I resist. Get behind my shield! With my own will, I resist. your names from all men. If 
fight like a soldier in the dirt. So the magnet. Rada Kull, I resist you. Get behind me. my own will, I resist you. You, 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 you,
dishonor her name and her station. You dishonor the forms. You would have revenge rather than paradise. The Pentasad has you under its hold, boy. Resist it. Vegas! Nisha's Yuchiba. Zichi. Enough! You must take me for someone that has limits. I am the very wellspring of magic. The very... Remember that time we pulled one over on the Upbridge Gang? I guess. I'm saying literally remember the time we pulled one over on the Upbridge Gang. Finally time to end your suffering. What? Alathon, and Saren, and fuck, man. Oh. Whew. Don't forget the Maladar. Right. And for the Maladar. No, dummy. Literally, don't forget the Maladar. It'll work. It's a bust. Too much corruption is pouring out of it too fast. Their absorption powers can't slow it down, much less cork it. Then what are we going to do? The wound's still growing. I'm thinking. Think faster. Rashanian Armada, this is the hand. Sandrak is dead and his madness is over. Stand down and disperse on my command. You've already figured out the solution, Jack. We win. Then we start thinking about how to fix the wound. Isn't there something else th that we can do about it, I mean? Of course. She never told you that immortals are charged with sacrificing themselves to heal the wound at the end of that tenure. Before you ask, yeah, it works. What? The mandate, the healing ritual, one that splits you from your magic, from your soul, it works. I never would have left the Immortals if it did. Ask too much of a person. Would it work on something this big? If I... Jumped in? Exploded yourself right next to the Binding Stone? Flooded all the fonts back into the Shrouded Realm? Yeah, could do. There's a hair of a mite. You won't survive, though. Good news? That bunny in your eyes is gone. And resolve... Powerful thing. You're the worst possible person to actually understand goodbyes. I'll tell her. Well, okay. 
You don't have time to teach me the ritual, so... Just stick it in your head on the way down. No. Listen, kid. If you're gonna jump, just... Just jump already. Jack? It'll be okay, Luna. Jack! What did he do? He fixed it. Never doubted him for a second. So, now that the wound's been unfucked for the moment... The rest is up to us. Magni Orders are gonna have to rewrite their entire magical playbooks, and include the Alori in them. West of the Orenthals, huh? That's a right nice stretch of green. Pretty hills, dark groves. Rook will love groves. They're all gardeners at heart, really. They deserve more. Yeah, well, what you started here, it's gonna spread. Lucium will follow our example. Yeah, sure it will. Word from Lavenry. Speak of the devil. Short version. The king and the dynastic families give their unending thanks. That's it? The language used was lovely, yet economical. No, I mean, did Kirkin... No word from her at all, sir. The king will recognize your claim as the head of your order, if you ask for it. She'll, uh, yeah, she'll come around. No, she won't. Yeah, likely not. She never did with me. You and Jack had the right of it, in a way I never did. Woke up right in time for the compliments. Keep them coming. There he is. You look good for someone that exploded. I got better. Paid having the Pentasad owe you a favor. Spit you back out the shrouded realm good as new. Your legs still seem a bit puddin' foot, though. Your, uh, <clears throat> friend left when she saw you were on the mend. She said she wasn't sure where she was gonna go. Yeah, that tracks. So what's next? Well, plenty of Sandrak loyalists are still out there, running amok and causing trouble, refusing to believe he's really dead. You got any loose ends, kid? Wouldn't expect to tie him up in peace. And what about the Immortals? Rasharn's withdrawing back to the front. We'll take advantage of that time and try to rebuild. And, uh, under your leadership? I take it you have an opinion on that. I mean, yeah. I, um, I think it should be you. I see. I was thinking the same thing. You were? Oh, that's great. Totally should be you, for sure. Totally. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Shouldn't be me at all, <laughs> right? Oh, hell no. Okay, well, that's a little rude. I mean, that would be the worst thing. <laughs> yeah, that could no. <clears throat> yeah, Literally no way, can't think right? <laughs> Anything But, like, worse. why not, though? Huh. Like, you ever... Like, you haven't even then thought about it? Being the leader. I'm, I mean... <laughs> We could. I'm, it's funny though. Okay. Listen, it's funny. It's you know, funny we've been idea. through a lot. We, I'd love to see it. Well, I don't. You know, maybe we should try. A trial. Just for, well, what is that? Just for shits and giggles. I think I've proven myself more than once. I, I healed the wound. 